Hallelujah. God bless you, friends. I want to read from the book of Psalm, Psalm 5, verse 12. He said, For you bless the righteous, O Lord, you cover him with favor as with a shield. If you read it from King James Version, it said, You surround the righteous with favor. I want to decree and prophesy into your weekend. I decree favor over your weekend. May favor be in the eyes of everyone that sees you, interact with you, engage in business with you, and loves you. May favor be above you, on you, beneath you, in front of you, and around you. May favor surround you as a shield in the mighty name of Jesus. May you experience the favor of God in the name of Jesus Christ. I pray that straight bullet will not hit you in the name of Jesus. You will not hear bad news. You will not receive bad news in the name of Jesus. May God deliver you from every power of the enemy. I bless you with the blessing of God in Jesus' name. My dear friends, I want to quickly introduce my book to you, The Fruit of the Tongue. You know, the word of the Lord says, my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. You see, knowledge cannot be imparted. You cannot transfer knowledge. It's not transferable and it's not imparted. How did you get knowledge? You read. Nobody can lay hand on you. Receive knowledge. It's not done that way. You can impart wisdom. But knowledge cannot be imparted. Hallelujah. And the Lord says, My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. If you want to have knowledge, you have to read. You have got to read. Hallelujah. You see, most people, they will not read. So sad. I pray for you. You see, one of the, one of the key that the enemy use against believer is ignorant. Ignorant. Lack of knowledge. Lack of knowledge. And if you want to be free of ignorance, you need to study. That's why Paul said to Timothy, study to prove yourself a workman who is not ashamed of himself, but rightly divide the word of truth. We can wrongly divide the word of truth if we don't know. And we are talking about wisdom. You know, wisdom is knowledge applied. You need knowledge. The Bible says, in all thy getting, get understanding. How do you get understanding? It's because of what you know. The Bible says, those that are not their God shall be strong and they shall do exploit. If you want to do exploit, you have to know. You need to know before you do exploit. You see, faith, I, I was saying to a group of people the other day, I said, we are talking about boldness. Boldness. I said, boldness is as a result of knowledge. You are very bold. It's as a result of what you know. You see, Peter and other apostles were so bold because they know. They know the Lord. They have spent time with Him. Hallelujah. Spend time with the Word and spend time with boots. And then you will know. I pray for you. And I know that this book has blessed so many people. I have sent it to uh, so many people. And if you want me to send you a copy, I want you to send me just $5. $5, 5 US dollar is for the post office. I want to send it to, we have few copies left now, about three to 400 copies left. I want to send it to people. He says, see, you are only going to pay for the post office. Just send the five US dollars to me, and I will post it to you. God bless you. And if you want to read the ebook copy, it's on our website 
you can also get that five US dollar. But if you don't have money, you don't have any seeds, and say, man of God, I don't have money, but I want to read your book. Send me an email. I will send the ebook to you. I promise you. God bless you. God richly blessed you. And I pray your weekend will be filled with good news. May God bless you. I want you to spend today to meditate on the book of Psalm 5 verse 12. Spend time to meditate on it. Think about that verse. Speak it out loud and clear. Say to yourself, this week, anybody that sees me will favor me. Anybody I get in contact with will favor me. Anyone that I interact with me will favor me. Anybody that I have business dealing with will favor me. In the mighty name of Jesus. You are saying to yourself, favor around me. Favor in front of me. Favor beneath me. Favor surround me like a she in Jesus' name. My dear friend, I want you to pray for us. Still trusting God to go to Holland for a program. And I also believe God to go to South Africa for two weeks program. And I also believe God to go to Nigeria, Abuja. And this cannot happen without your prayer and your support. I want you to pray for me and I want you to support me financially. If God lay it in your heart, say, man of God, I want to buy a ticket to Thailand or to South Africa or to Nigeria or to Holland, you can contact me with this email address and say, man of God, I want to buy your ticket. And believe me, as you do it, God will return the seed you sowed to you hundredfold in Jesus' name. I love you with the perfect love of Jesus. May God bless you today as always in Jesus' name. I remain your covenant brother, Brother Kevin. Shalom.